hi everyone welcome back to my youtube channel firstly thank you so much guys for the love that you've shown me with the past with the three videos that i've uploaded previously um wow i did not expect so much love thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you so much and then if you're here for the first time might as well just press that subscribe button and give the videos a thumbs up i'm so excited to be back i'm so excited that i made time again today to speak to you guys um, you know, as a mom, you just become so, so busy and so caught up in so many things that, yeah, you don't make <clears throat> time for other important things. So the reason we are here today is, uh, I just want to share with you guys the, um, some of the things that I cannot, cannot, cannot live without and, uh, some tricks that you can use with the items that you have in your household um least, uh, it's it's least expensive it's not expensive so yeah that's what i'm gonna share with you today so the first item i want to talk about is this thing over here so um they they normally give you these things at restaurants um uh, the the one the one spur the ones, uh, this one is from Ocean Basket. And then any other restaurant that you actually go to, they give you these things. So I normally take these things and actually ask for more. And I always have these things in my bag because they are so good with stains, especially like oil stains, actually any, any stain. But the trick of using this is that immediately when you see if there's a stain on something or you stain yourself with whatever you take this thing and rub it rub it rub it rub it, rub it on that stain and then yeah it helps us, it 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 um makes the stain not to stick long so yeah this is I, I, I don't know what this thing is called but i know that one of the main ingredients here is lemon yeah yeah it's lemon it's really 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 good with stain so whenever you go to restaurants i I really suggest that you collect these things and especially if you have kids you know uh, when you have kids stains are like a norm <laughs> so when you have this at least you have some help and then the second thing that I cannot live without that when there's a special I collect them is this thing over here I don't know where this thing is coming from and where it's been all my life. If you, as you can see that it's already finished because I use it for like everything that you can think of. It's also really, 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 really good with stain. So after you wrap this thing on the stain, you take, um, uh, you take this, you soak the stained item on this thing and then you're good to go. But I use this for almost everything, guys. First of all, for my white laundry, sometimes even my black laundry. But then there's a one, there's one for uh, black, where it, stay, where it says, helps black clothes stay black, yeah. But I always buy this one, cause it's like, guys, I use this for almost everything that you can think of. I use it for my walls, <laughs> yeah, for my walls. So when, you know, you know, you know, when you've got small kids, they would write on walls, they use pen and they'd use, um, what is this? A marking pen to mark on walls and all of that. So this thing helps me to remove the stains on the wall. Also bed stains, you know, sometimes, uh, little kids, they pee, have an accident on the bed, they pee on their beds, whatever this thing helps me remove that stain and you don't even you don't even need to do much so what i do is i usually use the um, i usually use this and then i put like a little bit maybe to this and so it's 50 percent 50 percent 50 percent of that and then the 50 percent should be in the water and you don't even need like um like a brush to remove that stain harshly just a simple, uh, what do we call? I don't know, in Skoro Brab in English, but it's Iskoropo. <laughs> Just Iskoropo, Jay. What, what do you call Iskoropo in English, man? Uh, you call it, I think it's a rag. Yeah, guys. Yeah, I think it's a rag. So you can take an old rag uh, or a, a face cloth or an old face cloth. And then you could just put the, a little bit of water in it and then put this thing in it. And then you remove the stain beds 
this thing can also wash beds but mostly i even use it for my carpet like i think i'll put a picture of my a picture of the carpet here yeah, so that you can see what kind of carpet it's not that rough carpet that's got um i don't know what i call that rough carpet i think it's a rag yeah yeah it's not for that rough carpet but i also use it for the rough carpet carpet for like my carpet is like straight okay i'll put a picture of my carpet here so that you can see it and also uh velvet um velvet couches so you know the the velvet is like uh, the in thing now when it comes to decoration so I, I also have some velvet in my bedroom also have it in in my um in my living area so this thing is like a life savior this other day my kids um they took a marking pen and then they wrote on my velvet couches this thing came to the rescue the other day i was drinking i was drinking coffee and an accident happened my kids just smacked that coffee and then it fell it 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 spilled all over my velvet couches and i used this thing to remove the stain so i use this thing for almost everything i mean even walls even walls you know so like i'm running you in coroping eye but i don't use it for my floors <laughs> i don't take it that far so if you want something to remove your stain guys have this and these things over here and then you will never ever ever struggle with stains ever again so the last item that i have da -da 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 -da, colgate <laughs> so you're sure you're wondering what i use colgate for i use colgate to keep my ring sparkly can you see can you see it's all sparkly and clean and it's all of this so i did um a video to demonstrate how i clean my ring using this let's check the video out <music> like uh i clean my ring like three times a year because i think this also has some um, okay i don't want to try it like to clean it maybe every week and stuff but i think it should have some um negative uh impact on cleaning the jewelry uh, cleaning your jewelry with it i'm just not sure what it is because i tried i actually tried to google and try to research what is in this thing that makes this thing to clean ring why why what does it have i know that it's got fluoride and then it says the active ingredient here is sodium monofluorophosphate and then when i checked what is this monofluorophosphate it's actually uh, an ingredient of fluoride right and then fluoride we know that it um prevents your tooth from decaying and also keeps away cavity and that's about it 
and then so i don't know what's so special about this thing but it absolutely worked and how i found out about this actually um i found out on facebook this other this other lady just said that she uses this thing to clean her ring and i've been wanting to get my ring cleaned up for like years and years because i went to um i went to american swiss and asked them well i want my ring cleaned can you please clean my ring for me and then they said uh oh, well we just we, we're gonna take the ring for like a week or so and send it for evaluation and after evaluation they're gonna tell they, they're gonna report back on on how on, on where it needs to be cleaned how much it needs to be cleaned and yeah you'll probably not have your ring for like a month and i was like hey i'm not gonna live without my ring <laughs> for a month so then i kept on so then i just i just decided that well i'll just i don't know i'll just wear it dirty i guess and then this lady shared uh this and it, it has to be this colgate specifically this 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 colgate specifically then she said that it's what it's what she cleans her ring with and then what i found out is that i also cleaned my silver my silver engagement ring with this it does it makes it look nice and shiny but it works more on white gold because this ring is like it's gold here and then it's got diamondish stuff here so it works on rings that are like this so for silver it makes it look it makes it look clean as well i don't want to lie and also i uh, also cleaned my husband's silver ring and uh well it worked so yeah maybe try this but before you try this maybe try and do your own research on how Ooh, the kids are up Okay, but I'm completing this video anyway. Okay, so maybe before you use this on your jewelry, just try and check out like um, um, if it's going to have any negative impact. But I've been using this for two years. And like I said, I use it like uh, three times a year to clean, my, um, to clean my ring. I don't use it every week because it doesn't need cleaning. Really. Like I cleaned this last week. It doesn't need cleaning like... Uh, regular oh, this word regularly Le regular you got me miss you understand that word <laughs> it doesn't need to be cleaned all the time okay that's it for me for today um if i discover any anything else that uh, i think you guys will benefit from i'll make a video on it and thank you so much once again for showing me so much love for the past uh, three videos that I uh, made. And I hope you subscribe and I hope you tell your friends to come and watch these amazing videos. And uh, yeah, see you guys next time. Goodbye.